welcome you back to Black Sight tonight. We're going to talk about Roland's Martin video on Kamala Harris when a man walked across showing his man buns. First, I would like for you to subscribe to this channel, hit that like button, hit that notification button, but also comment on this video. This was one of the most shocking videos you would ever see, and it's a total embarrassment for Roland Martin. They said this was a whole accident that a video actually showed up. But if this was a video and it wasn't live, it should have been edited. Now, in editing, you go ahead and basically delete what you don't want in the video. But somebody happened to not delete that part in the video. Now, was that by mistake of the person doing the video? Or was somebody watching something they wasn't supposed to be watching? So you know his enemies came out in full force, starting with Angela Stanton, who basically said that 90% of the male Democrats are bisexual or switcher rules. And she was commenting on this on that Roland Martin video. Because that's kind of weird. But he said it just showed up as an advertisement. But advertisements only show up on your video if you actually watching those videos. You have to understand social media advertising. Whatever you watch, that's what shows up in the advertisement. So he's trying to get out of this. You got Black, Black Alpha Network. You know he's funny as hell showing videos and making memes of Roland Martin because I always feel that these Democrat males from him, Charlemagne the God, and these other people, they don't show male testosterone. They don't show things that average males would show when it comes to politics. They are more feminine type men, the type that Dana Bash was saying on CNN that Democrats is going on after the more feminine males in society. So this video basically proves to me that this man may have a little bit of sugar in his tank. You know, that I believe a lot of these male figures that you see crying on the air, Snobbling on the air, screaming on the air. All of them might be with a cabal, with the Democrats. And see, I like this because Roland Martin has disrespected so many people on this internet. So many people who have a different view, who see the world in a different eye. The world see the political world in a different eye. He has no respect for. So now it's time for people to come down on him. And I'm telling you, they're coming out in full force after Roland Martin. Is this the real Roland or one that's on the DL? And I'm telling you right now, this brother right here, he's going to blame it on MAGA. He gonna bring it on the Republicans. He gonna say they trying to sabotage me. You know he's gonna say that. You know they are going to try and say that. But we know who you are, Roland. You are a operator of or a creator of chaos in the black community. You are basically who Kamala is paying to destroy anybody who stands up against her in the black community she is using every tactic to tone down anybody in a black community that is speaking up against her and you are the person or the point man for that group and there's plenty of you out there receiving a nice paycheck for what you're doing you hoping if she wins, she's going to give you a job. But let me tell you how they feel about people like you. 
Once they use you, they throw you away. And that's what they're going to do to Roland. See, Roland thought he was going to get that job with Hillary. And now he's back in 2024 doing the same thing. But pictures like that, he don't like. Because pictures like that will help him get destroyed by the same people he wants to accept them. Roland Martin could be one of the biggest frauds in the media just because of the way he acts towards his own people. Anybody who disagrees with him, he attacks them. Like he is the superior person in the room. This is the problem with the boule. They have all these members who believe that they should speak for us. You shouldn't speak for yourself. They should speak for you. But most of these boule members are degenerates. That's all they want is access to white women. All they want is access or to sit next to power. They could care less about how you live in the black community. They speak the words, but don't have any actions. He'll tell you he's got all the actions in the world. He'll tell you about his credentials, his credibility, what he has done. But when it all comes down to it, Roland has done nothing to affect change in the black community but open his damn mouth. And this is why there are going to be so many people out here going after him. Because they don't see him as a unifier in the black community. He is divider. He is one of those people who believe of the talented temp that those who have the highest education, who have achieved the highest levels, should speak for black people. That you should sit there and wait to follow his orders. Or those who are making the most, most money's orders. But that's not how it's done. Because the people who make the most don't want to lose anything. They want to gain. But the people at the bottom who work hard want to affect change. Because when it happens, everybody moves up. This is why everybody will be coming at the Roland Martin's neck because he deserves it. I would love to hear your comments in the comments section. I want to thank you for listening to Black Sight. Hope you subscribe to this channel. Smash that like button, but also share this video.